This is number four on the California State Standards Star Test Review. A student records the mass and volume of a lump of clay, X, and then you add a second lump of clay, Y, to lump X, and graph its mass and volume. Then you add another lump, Z, to X plus Y, and you graph that. So they have some conclusions. What's the most logical conclusion about the clay? Well, if you look at the effect of adding y to x, well, let's see, how much did it change when we added y? Well, it went to the right, and it didn't go up too much. So it went to the right, meaning adding y adds a good amount of volume, but not much mass. It doesn't rise very much. So y, we know, has a low amount of mass, but a higher volume. So higher volume. I'll put higher v. When we add z to all this, I'm going to erase this right now. When we add z, notice that adding z to this x plus y amount makes the point go up and to the right, about the same amount each time, so like to the right and to up, about the same amount, which means it's adding about the same amount of volume as it is adding mass. So we might guess that the density of z's density um, might be close to one whole because its mass over volume is about equal to one to one ratio. So regardless of the number for z's density, the important thing is um, just looking at these possible answers and figuring out which could possibly be true. Well, lump z has the greatest mass. If it had the greatest mass, if letter A were true, then adding z would mean this point would be much higher because here we are adding x. Oh, well, that's about one and a half grams. If we were to add y, that's a tiny bit. If z were the biggest mass, we'd have to add more than one and a half grams to this. The point would be over three. It would be up here somewhere or higher if a were true, and it's not. So we know a is not true. Um, in letter b, lump z has the lowest density. If it had the lowest density, then it would have only a tiny bit of mass and a lot of volume. So if z had the lowest, we'd have a little bit higher, but way over to the right. It would be like over here, um, adding z. But it isn't, so lump b is not, uh, letter b is not correct. Lump y had the lowest density. Well, that is the correct answer. Um, why is D not correct? Y had the greatest mass. Well, no, because y, adding Y adds volume, not mass. So you just have to read on the side what is that label. Well, it's adding volume.